Chaka chaka, your, your reputation depends on this. Chaka chaka chaka. In today's video, guys, we are going to be doing a comparison of Bamboo, Trove, and Chaka, three of the biggest fintech apps in Nigeria used to invest in the US stock market from Nigeria. The goal is to find out which of them is best in buying stocks in the US from Nigeria. By the way, my name is Mike Rumaka and right here on my YouTube channel, I make videos around business, personal finance and tech and if this interests you, please do yourself and do me a favor by smashing the like button so that YouTube algorithm can recommend this video to more people and also hit the subscribe button, join the family, the goal is to hit 10,000 subscribers and without much talks, let's dive right into today's video, let's go. We are basically going to be using five things to judge these apps. The first one is the onboarding process. This has to do with how easy it is for you to sign up on these platforms. The second one has to do with the interface. This has to do with how easy it is for you to basically navigate through the app and make use of it for your investment journey. The third thing we are going to be using to judge these apps, the features. I've been able to go through the three apps and play around with their features and I'll be able to give you 100% feedback on which of them has the best features in terms of investing in the US stock market from Nigeria. The fourth thing we're using to judge these apps is going to be their ratings on Google. It's very, very likely that if you're going to be making use of Bamboo Trove and Taka on your mobile device, you'll be needing to download it on your phone. I'll go to the Google Play Store, go through and see which of them has the best rating on Google and also which of them has the best user feedback. The fifth thing we're going to be using to judge these apps as well is going to be how fast do your customer support get back to you once you contact them. Starting off with the onboarding process, signing up on Bamboo was a little bit harder than signing up on Taka and also signing up on Trove was much more harder. Onboarding yourself or signing up on Bamboo. Basically, when you install the app on your device, you click on the Bamboo app, they're basically going to ask you for a lot of details like your first name, your gender, your date of birth, your citizen, which is Nigeria, and all that stuff. But when it comes to signing up on Taka, it was a little bit much more faster. They basically just requested for my email address, my password, which has to be eight digits, and then a referral code if I had anyone that referred me to the app. And I just signed up. This is just the first stage. I believe that the goal of Taka was is just to actually get you to start using the app. Why the goal of Bamboo is to get to know you and make sure that you're a credible person. Truth is actually the same as Bamboo. It took more time signing up on Truth as well on, on Bamboo, but it was much more faster on Taka. Taka took me less than one minute, while Bamboo took me more than three minutes in onboarding myself on the app. After signing up on Bamboo, you need to get onboarded by the Bamboo team. Basically, theirs is a manual process. They have to basically go through everything you have put in, all the details you have put in before they allow you to start trading using the Bamboo app. But when it comes to Chaka, they just once you just sign up using your email address and your password, then you now need to get verified and you need to get onboarded on the platform. So you also need to submit your NIN, your passport and a utility, which is your NEPA bill that has your address. When it comes to Truth, Truth was is also the same thing. They are going to manually onboard you on the platform. For Bamboo, it took me only two days to get onboarded on Bamboo. When it comes to Truth, it, it took me four days because I tried using Truth the first time and I was not able to get onboarded. They rejected my NIN and every other stuff and I had to still apply again and it took some time. I even had to contact their customer support which you're going to find out more in this video before I actually got onboarded on Truth. Why when it comes to Chaka, Chaka is here to verify me. I just recently signed up on the app and still getting to understand how the app works. Hopefully Chaka doesn't waste as much time as Truth and Bamboo. When it comes to my experience in signing up or onboarding myself on these different platforms, I would say I prefer that of Bamboo because this is actually investment and me seeing that they are asking me for much details in terms of my name and my NIM before actually seeing the app makes me feel that they are much more credible than other platforms. So I would rate it Bamboo first in terms of onboarding, Truth and then Chaka is last. In terms of the interface, I would say I would pick Bamboo over Truth and Chaka and here's why again. When I signed up on the Bamboo app, I found it much more easier actually making use of the app. On my first time using the app, it was very very easy. I understood how every button on the app works. So it was much more easier for me. But making use of Truth, everything looked scattered because 
Truth is actually broad. You can do a lot of investments using the Truth app. You can invest in Nigerian stock market. You can invest in US stock market. And I believe you can actually invest in the Chinese stock market. So it's a little bit much more confusing making use of the Truth app, not Truth. Making use of the Truth app. Then coming over to Taka. Taka is, well, I see theirs is the most complicated because. I'm actually yet to even fund my account because I don't even understand how their app work. There are lots of things going on on the on the Chaka app. It's very very confusing. But Bamboo is so simple and sleek. Even though they have one or two tweaks they need to make, I find their interface much more easier. So if I was to read in terms of interface, I would say Bamboo first, Truth second, and Chaka third again. Talking about the features of Bamboo Truth and Chaka, I would say that Truth beats Bamboo and Chaka hands down. When it comes to features, there's a key feature that Truth has that made me prefer Truth over Chaka and Bamboo. And that key feature is making use of a demo account. As a stock trader or a stock investor, it's very, very important that you test your skills before you start investing in the stock market. And Truth has given you the opportunity to actually make use of a demo account on the app in investing in the US stock market and also investing in the Nigeria stock market and the EU bond. Talking about the rating on the Google Play Store, Bamboo has over 500,000 downloads with a 3.9 rating. This might actually fluctuate, but for a company that has 500,000 and a 3.9 rating, I don't like it. Then coming over to Truth, Truth has over 100,000 downloads with a 4.3 rating and then Chaka has a 100,000 download with a 3.7 rating, which is very, very poor. Talking about the user base or the downloads which these apps have, I think the land downloads is actually okay because they are not targeting the whole world. Their target market is Africa. And if you check very well, you see that 70% of the downloads these softwares actually have is from Nigeria. Now, back to the rating. For Bamboo, I would say their rating of 3.9 is very, very poor. It's not good. 100,000 downloads is okay, but 3.9 is bad. They should have been aiming or they should be aiming for a 4.0 to 4.5 rating. Why through 4.3 is okay, it's, it's, it's not good, but it's manageable, it's actually manageable. Why for Taka 3.7 is so, so poor. It says a lot about the company. I will encourage them to improve on some of the feedbacks their customers are actually giving them. As you can see on your screen here, there are some purple feedbacks on the Chaka app and as well on the Bamboo app and the Truth app. But if I was to rate them according to their rating on the Google Play Store, I would rate Truth first. Truth actually came first for having 100,000 downloads and a 4.3 rating. Why Bamboo will come second? I know they have much more downloads than Truth, but if you check properly and do your math, well, you find out that Truth actually beat Bamboo in terms of rating and then Chaka comes last. So it's basically going to be through first, bamboo second, and chaka third, not last. <laughs> the final way we are going to be using to rate these apps is using the effectiveness and fast response of their customer support. I reached out to the bamboo customer support, telling them that is it possible for me to be able to withdraw my $20 which I funded my bamboo when I signed up on the app. And when I actually sent them that particular message by around 12 p.m. and it took them around 15 minutes before they responded to me. They actually have a, an automatic response and they told me you will get replies here and in, in your email. Our usual reply time is a few minutes. They didn't actually specify how many minutes they are going to reply which is bad because very likely they might read the message depending on the kind of message I send them. They might read it and decide to respond late or they are not specific in how long or in how long they are going to reply me but they actually replied me in 15 minutes and the reply was actually okay now coming over to truth i reached out to the truth team telling them i find it difficult getting started with using truth my account sign up is being delayed yes my account sign up was actually being delayed and in less than 20 minutes they replied to me telling me your account will be verified within one to two business days, which I find interesting. But one thing I actually find more interesting is that you get replies here and in your email. Our usual reply time is 10 minutes, which is wonderful. This, this is actually wonderful because they are specific in how long they are actually going to reply me, which I find much more better than that of Bamboo. And I think they actually replied me in 10 minutes, though I said 20 minutes earlier. I think they did because I first of all, I sent my message to the Bamboo team 
first of all and then immediately the bamboo message came in the proof reply actually came in as well so i would, I would say proof replied me very very fast then coming over to taka i actually tried contacting the support team i saw different options in terms of contacting customer support and i went ahead in instead of just texting them and calling them because they gave me an option to call bamboo did not give me an option to call Proof did not give me an option to call but taka gave me an option to actually text them on telegram to text them on whatsapp and to even call them and I proceeded in calling them. So this is support. I'm going to contact their support. Let's see if that support is faster than that of Truth. I've texted Truth. It's Chaka's turn. Let's call the number. Okay, the number is ringing, guys. Let's see how it goes. Is Chaka going to pick up? Is Chaka going to pick up? Chaka, 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 Chaka. Chaka, Chaka, your reputation depends on this. Chaka, Chaka, Chaka. Good morning. Yeah, hello, good morning. Good morning. You want to check my business? Yeah, my name is Micah Irumaka. Okay. Yeah, I just signed up on Chaka on the Chaka app. Okay. And requesting for my BVN. I just wanted to be sure before I put in my BVN, like you know, trust issues and all that stuff. Yeah. Um, yes, please. We need your BVN number. Yeah. To be able to verify your account here. So so um for you to like for your account to be for your to be able to be to be to be, uh, to be verified, you need to enter your BVN number, and our platform is hundred percent secure. Okay, so um, like I won't face any like challenges in the future when it comes to my personal account, like my no, bank and other to. stuff. No, you will not. Sir. Okay, so um, once I sign up, I can actually create, once I'm, I put in my BVN and my account is verified, I can now like credit my like fund my wallet right and start investing and yes, all that stuff. Yes. Yes, yes. Okay, so if, if I have any issues, can I put a call across again? Yes, you can, sir. Okay, thank you so much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Yeah, and you too, yeah. Boom. Chaka is good. <laughs> okay, that's amazing. Unlike other Nigerian companies, I think this is wonderful. This is exceptional customer service. In terms of customer support, I will read Chaka first and then read through second, and Bamboo will come third. When it comes to customer support now that you have done a comparison on bamboo truth attacker i know you guys are eager to know which one do you mike irumaka prefer personally i prefer bamboo over truth and taka for now but it's very very likely that my preference will change because truth gives me more options to invest in other markets and to also invest in nigeria why bamboo is just focused on the u.s stock market so it's very, very likely on the long run that i'll be making use of truth and also the demo account which truth has i actually find that interesting bamboo does not have that so like i said i'll very, very likely make use of truth on the long run i want you guys to leave a comment telling me which one you prefer probably some of you might prefer taka or truth or even bamboo it's up to you all of us have a reason for each platform that we decide to use in investing in the u.s stock market from nigeria as well there will be a link in the description in case you want to sign up on any of these platforms use my link so i can earn some affiliate commissions you know for my hustle which i'm currently putting in the effort right now as well do not forget to smash the like button and hit the subscribe button and join the youtube family i have other wonderful videos on my channel i actually made a video on how to invest in the u.s stock market making use of the bamboo app and i'm also going to be making a, a video in the future on how to use chakra and truth 